Hi, everyone, and welcome to Big Ideas Growing Minds. We are so happy you are here. Please consider subscribing to the channel. Your support means the world to us. Today's big idea comes from Mike Viking in his cozy book, The Little Book of Huga, The Danish Way to Live Well. Through a page turning narrative, Mike explores the Danish concept of Huga, reflects on what makes the Danish some of the happiest people in the world, and guides the readers on how to create more Huga in their own lives. Here is our take on the highlights from the book. Highlight number one Huga and happiness. Denmark's position as one of the happiest countries in the world has been established many times. But why are the Danes so happy? According to Mike Viking, a vital part of the Danish recipes for happiness is huga. The word huga originates from a Norwegian word meaning well being, and this is actually an excellent way to describe huga since taking part in something huga like makes you feel good. Huga can be used to describe an atmosphere, a relationship, a situation, a thing, and basically anything that is cozy, sincere, and enjoyable. It almost goes without saying that spending time with friends, colleagues, or family is often quite Huga like. But spending time alone can also be Huga like. For example, if it's cold and raining outside, but you are inside working on your sofa while quiet piano music is playing in the background and your cat and dog are sleeping next to you. Number two, places that are Huga like. While homes may be a central station for Huga, it is definitely possible to have a very Huga like time outside the home as well. You can Huga on a boat, outdoors, in nature, at your summer cabin, a restaurant or museum, or basically anywhere that makes you happy and allows you to feel relaxed and connected. Number three, things that are Huga like. Number one, candles. There's no faster way to get to a Huga than to light a few candles and don't feel restricted to only light them in your living room. You can have them in the office, in the boardroom, and the bathroom, literally anywhere, just as long as you remember to stay clear of obvious fire hazards and air of the room after you put the candles out. Number two, cozy lighting. You cannot have true Huga without comfortable illumination. So, select your lamps carefully and take extra time when placing them around the house. A good Huga tip is to place several smaller lamps around the room and dim the light. Three, fireplaces. Four, comfortable clothes, including woolen socks and oversized jumpers. Five, cakes. Huga is all about being kind to yourself and others. Therefore, delicious foods and drinks often play a big part when creating Huga. Six, and finally, cozy home decors. For example, things made of wood, blankets and cushions, ceramics, books, and so on. Number four, the Huga Manifesto. In a nutshell, Huga is a situation with relaxed thoughtfulness, a time where nobody takes center stage or dominates the conversation for long stretches of time, a setting where everyone is considered equal and acts accordingly. It is a situation where you can feel completely relaxed, calm, and just be yourself. Let's end with the manifesto for Huga. Number one, atmosphere. Create a Huga like environment, ambiance, and mood. Number two, presence. Turn off your phones and be present in the moment. Number three, pleasure. Coffee, chocolate, cakes, and the more, the better. Number four, equality. Put we over me. Help the host and listen just as much as you talk. Number five, gratitude. Be thankful. Number six, harmony. It's not a competition. Just be yourself. Number seven, comfort. Wear comfortable clothes and choose a relaxing setting. Number eight, truce. No drama. Leave political disputes or family quarrels to another time. Number nine, togetherness. Cherish relationships and create shared narratives. Number 10, shelter. This is your tribe, a place of peace and security. And there you have it, the little book of Huga by Mike Viking in a nutshell. We hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please remember to give it a like. Take care and see you soon.